of the big differences I feel for HMH-462 and a lot of the other units. We have that tradition and we have that strong family and unity with us all. This group is what we call ourselves. It's a strong nickname, it's a strong family title that we uphold to our best ability. You know, we work together, we hang together, and we always take care of our Marines. Some of the qualities that make a good maintainer would be just a, a motivation. The motivation and the dedication to continue driving in a job that often does have hardships. You know, we go out there, we work in the rain or the sweltering heat. It's all a part of the job, but when it comes down to it, as long as you can stay motivated and continue driving, no matter the circumstance, I think that's, that's one of the biggest things. Just a never-ending motivation and drive to keep learning and to continue with the job even when we're faced with hardships. Especially referred to ourselves as the screw crew just because the um, the squadron and pretty much most of the 53 squadrons you just find yourself in uh, hard circumstance with the uh, the amount of the amount of work that goes into uh, getting these aircraft ready to fly. We got Marines volunteering to stay late through their shift into the next shift uh, all night long working on the aircraft just to get the plane out. So there's a lot of there's a lot of camaraderie. I don't think there's anything bad about being a flight mechanic. I mean, who else gets to work on a gajillion dollar piece of machinery that can do everything from gun runs to supply drops, helo casting, spy rope. Like, I get to see the coolest stuff the Marine Corps has to offer firsthand, and I get to be a part of that. There's really no downside to it in my eyes.